Hey guys, so I am going on a trip. I'm going to Nashville for a week and I thought I would share with you guys what makeup I'm bringing because I definitely downsized the amount of makeup I normally use and I'm also only traveling with a carry-on. So I had to greatly minimize the amount of liquid products to accommodate for my other liquids, you know, like body wash and shampoo conditioner because those are precious um, and I need those kinds of things and that little space is just like it's gold. So anyway, this is what I'm going to be bringing with me. So I thought I would share, um, yeah, let's go ahead and start. Um, I will be bringing like a multitude of brushes and all of that, um, but this is just like the actual makeup makeup. So uh, I'm going to start with my face and I'm bringing one primer. I'm bringing the Skin Iceland Pure Pore Minimizer. Um, since this is a squeeze tube, I can, you know, kind of get this to shape in the bag pretty good. I just kind of stick it in the back. Um, so yeah, this is what I'm bringing for a primer. For foundation, I went out and purchased a new foundation. I've been wanting to try this foundation, but I was kind of waiting for now to try it because this would be a good excuse to try it. So this is the Anastasia Stick Foundation. I did get the shade Porcelain. I have it on today. I feel like it matches me pretty good right now, but I'm a little bit worried if I get sun that it might not match, but I'll make it work. Anyway, um, yeah, I this is the first day I'm wearing it, so we will see. But this is the foundation I'm going to bring with me because it's a stick, so you don't have to put it in your liquids bag. Genius. And I've also heard it's good for oily skin, which I have. For concealer, I'm bringing two. I'm bringing the Pixie by Petra, the Brightening Peach Concentrate. I love this. This is a solid, so I do not need to put this in my liquids bag. Um, and then I am bringing a liquid concealer. This is the NYX HD concealer in the shade Fair. I am going to be putting this in my liquids bag because it's like in this container. Um, but I feel like I'm doing pretty good in that department. For powder, I'm bringing two. I'm bringing my Tarte Smooth Operator. This is my favorite powder of life. It works really well for me. And then I'm also bringing the powder. I never really talk about this one too much on my channel, but it lives in my purse. It's the Cover FX Blotting Powder. Um, and I have the shade Light. And I stuck a little Tarte brush that I had in here. So um, yeah, that's what the powder looks like. I usually use this and has a mirror, which is awesome for touch-ups. I use this after I use a blotting sheet. So I just got a fresh pack. These are from NYX. They work for me. Um, so I blot my skin and then I apply my powder because at least I'm getting the oil off and then I can powder down any excess shininess. So that is going to be with me too. For like face color, I'm going to bring my Jane bronzer. Um, this is in the shade Inspire. It already broke. Um, so I feel like if it does break, it's not the end of the world, um, but yeah, so this is the one I'm going to be bringing with me. Again, I do have this on today. And then for blush, I'm bringing one. I'm bringing the Too Faced Love Flush in Baby Love. Um, I really, really like this one. I haven't had too many issues with my makeup breaking from travel, but I always keep it in the back of my mind. And this is something where if it were to break, I do have this in the palette I'm using. Um, so it wouldn't be that awful because I have a backup of it and that's kind of my rationale. And I love the color. Again, have it on today. Um, today was kind of like a test run of the makeup I'm going to be wearing. I put it on. Um, I am heading to work in about 30 minutes or so, so I will see how it wears throughout the day and all of that. Um, and then I'm bringing my Kevin Aquan co um, Contour Pup. What? What is this going to be called? I'm bringing my Kevin Aquan Contour Book Palette, whatever you want to call it. Um, so I'm going to be using this as a contour. I'm going to be using this one as my highlight. And then I have some eyeshadows here as well. I am bringing an eyeshadow palette, but it's nice to have these ones. I use this one every day. Obviously, there's pan. So I'm bringing that, and it does have a mirror in it, which is nice, um, but I am going to be bringing this little mirror I got once upon a time that has powder on it from Sephora, and um, this one has, oh good, it shattered, good. This one shattered, but this side still works, but you can prop it up, so I figured that might be a good thing to have. I might see if I have a second one, because I didn't know the shattered, but we'll see. Um... Okay, face. What else do I have for my face? I think that's it for my face. Yeah. Okay, let's move on to eye products. So I'm bringing my eyeshadow primer. Of course, this is from Wet n Wild. This will go in my liquids bag, but this is like almost empty, so no big deal. Um, 
For eyeshadow, I'm bringing the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette, and this is going to be my one month one palette for July. Um, I don't know what order videos are going up because I pre-filmed a bunch of them. But anyway, um, this is the one I'm bringing, and I really enjoy this palette. It has a matte white, which I use every day. It has a matte bright pink, which I use every day. It has a shimmery kind of light shade. I have some golds, I've got some purples. So I know a lot of people are panning this palette this year, um, and I have thought about you know trying to hit pan on some of these shades I wouldn't pan at all um, but anyway I just thought I would use this this month and it has everything in here that I need I have dark shades I've got plenty of transition shades so I don't need to bring extra eyeshadows and like I said I do have the um, Kevin Aquan palette as well to aid with this one if I need I'm bringing both of my eyeliners. I have the Laura Geller um, in Blue Moon which is a navy liner and then my nude liner of course oh I forgot to mention these guys um, this is my stick Thing from Essence, the two-in-one shadow liner. It's stick so I don't have to put in my liquids bag, yay. Um, and then I'm also bringing the Essence Lash Princess Mascara. I might try and fit the Essence Get Big Lashes in as well because this is waterproof. I think I'm gonna try. I don't know if it's gonna work, but I'm for sure bringing um, the Lash Princess one with me. Okay, so then for brows, I have the NYX Tame and Frame, my normal brow product, so nothing new there. And then for lip products, um, I'm for sure bringing a chapstick with me, and the one I like is the Kiss My Face SPF 30 um, Sport Treatment um, one, so this one I will have with me. And then I will also have my Buxom Amsterdam um, lipstick, and um, this is the full-on lipstick. I'm panning this one, so it would be a nice time to really power through with that one. And then I'm debating bringing another lipstick or not. I probably will bring this one. I don't know if I'll wear it, but this is the custom one that I made um, from Bite. And it's just like a rosy shade, um, deeper than what I have on now. But anyway, I just thought maybe like at night I might want that. I don't know. I'll be there through the 4th of July, so I might try to do something fun with my makeup. You know, get like artsy and stuff. <laughs> okay, what am I forgetting? Oh, I am bringing a setting spray. I am using the Scandinavia Oil Control Setting Spray right now. And I have this old little baby Urban Decay All Nighter spray bottle. So I filled this up with this. Um, I normally use like this size, which is one ounce, but this one is even smaller. It's the cutest, it's half of an ounce. So I remember getting this and thinking I should keep that bottle. And sometimes that's like a good thing to do. It's just, if you get packaging from samples, maybe save some of those bottles because they come in handy. So this will last me for sure for the week. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited. So that is the makeup I'm going to be bringing. Um, I probably posted a picture on Instagram by now. Um, of it all laid out just in case because I kind of want to do like a fancy layout, you know. Um, anyway, so yeah, that is all I have. I will be in Nashville for a week. Like I said, I do have some videos, um, you know, pre-recorded and stuff, but not like all of them or anything. So we'll see what happens. Um, it also depends on how good the internet connection is where I am. So yeah, that is that. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.